about Barnacle Boy, but when were you going to tell me that you had a kid, though, and that he had four kids? Like, I didn't know you were a grandpa. Congratulations. I didn't even know you had a kid. Like, I thought we were cool. I thought we were close. I th when were you going to tell me this? Wait, what's that? Oh, the viewers are here. Oh, my bad. Hey, y'all. What's up, Ant City? And welcome back to some more SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I was just, you know catching up with barnacle boy because i didn't know he had children like we just found this out last episode he just he just wasn't gonna tell us which is crazy but in the last one though we started rock bottom and we got through like most of that area i died a lot and now we're finally here in the museum and yeah we already talked to barnacle boy let's see if he has anything else to say what are you waiting for kid get in there bro don't, don't you dare rush me after you didn't tell me you had kids like that's just disrespectful you're just gonna be outright rude to me like that anyways yeah so we gotta Go ahead and start the museum. Yeah, there's a bunch of lasers. Look at this top security. Like, bro, who made these paintings? Like, Neptune himself must have painted this for this high-level security. Like, there's no other reason. This is just excessive. And, like, who's going to come in here stealing them little stupid robots outside? Like, bro, I guess they're already inside, huh? But anyways, let's just go ahead and get started now. So, uh, well, I can't go there. I'm assuming we got to go to this button. So, let's... Please don't die already. I cannot start this video off with a death. Okay. All right, let's get up here. Look at that. Boom. And boom. Shot him off. Blew him up. All right. Cool. Do you think I can? Do you think I can no scope that button from here? Let's try it. Okay. No, it's too far. It's too far. All right. That would have been cool though. Uh, all right. Let's head back down. Uh, did that one just stop shooting lasers? Oh, he shoots him up there. So we gotta go quick. Okay. Ooh. Oh no. What am I supposed to do? I'm getting mixed. I was gonna come. Look at that! I'm still. SpongeBob just died while standing straight up. What? Okay. That just wasn't fair, though. I was getting comboed. Like, what was that about? And now I gotta go hit this button over here again. Great. I thought I learned the timing. Guess not. All right. Get up here. Hit that button again. Blow him up. All right. All right, SpongeBob. Anyway, so let's head down here. We gotta go here. Then we're gonna quickly make our way this way. When he stops shocking there, we're gonna jump. Alright, go. But when he shocks these two. Okay, we're gonna go hit that button now. But yeah, y'all saw that I was just getting comboed in between those two platforms. There's nothing I could have done about it. Fresh, Grab this underwear. Hit the button, please. Why is this? <laughs> Who made this painting and it's hanging up in the like look at this. This I mean it's kinda it's kinda it's kinda beautiful, honestly. No. <laughs> but like for real, like the, they got this first grader art in here hanging up with this maximum security like bro who would steal that who would steal this you said me i would steal it yeah you're right it's kind of it's kind of fire i'm just saying like look at that it's an actual replica of bikini bottom right there like maybe they could have put a little more color and detail maybe yeah but it's still it's still a good concept there's really a sniper robot on those platforms bro why'd they make why they decide to just make this level so hard I'm gonna have to sneak. All right, I guess I gotta hit those two buttons next. So we're gonna wait for the lasers to come back. Yeah, so hit there. Then when that one's done, I'm jumping. Too early, too early, too early. I went way too early. I jumped the gun. Let that one end, and then we're gonna go up. That one ended now. Oh my God, I timed it. All right, I'm gonna hit that one. Blow this dude up. And then, where we go? How do we get up there? Right. Dude, can I snipe him for the top? Oh, I can! Wow, look at that! I am a pro gamer, I'm telling y'all. I'm just, I'm just built different. Uh, oh, okay. So I can get up to that. That, was, that. I'm an idiot, that's what I was supposed to do. You see the button on the left? I was supposed to go from the platform where Barnacle Boy was at, but I didn't do that. Oh, well, we'll go back. And there's a sock underneath here, so whenever we shut off the security, we gotta come back here to the beginning. But yeah, you see this that's falling over? I'm supposed to go up here like this. And then jump over like this, and then hit this button. I was supposed to kill this guy first. <laughs> oh, and that shut off all the security. Okay, cool. We hit all the buttons. So now, let's go grab that sock. That was the first thing I just saw. So let's grab this. What's he running from? Oh, are these robots on him? What is SpongeBob scared of? Oh, what? What is he scared of? Oh, is it this dude? No, it's... Oh, yeah, it was that dude. What? Okay, SpongeBob, he was like 30 yards away from it, from you minding his own business. What are you scared of him for, bro? Like, calm down. Jeez. But, um, yeah, okay, now we got rid of all of that security. They, really, they're, they had all of them lasers hooked up to five buttons. That's that's crazy. 
Yeah, we can just sneak past this guy. We can actually snipe him from the top, apparently. Try this. There's I almost got like him. Smell of bubbles in the morning. Yeah, okay, so we gotta tiptoe. Victory. Tiptoe to him. Kill him, there you go. There's another one over here by this box. We're gonna get him. Oh, there's more lasers in here. Look at that guy over there hitting that name, man. You see? He's like, I think he's supposed to be scared, but he's just sitting here dancing. Dang, look at look at him vibe. These fish in this game vibe, and y'all, <laughs> I've, I've I've been seeing people asking me like, why I'm always beating up the fish. I, look, they just have these little goofy animations. We hit like, look at this. He always scr he scratched the back of his neck, bent all the way forward. Look at that. Why does he have to go that far to scratch his neck? He doesn't, and he's got his little tongue sticking out and stuff. Like, bro, I don't know. It's just fun. It's just funny to beat up these fish. <laughs> like, that's all I can say about. Like, they just have little dumb animations, and it's hilarious. Like, look, why is he bending his neck all the way forward to scratch it? Like, bro, you don't need that much space. Anyway, let's hit this button. That spawned a robot. Whoa. Spawned in the security guard. Did I just see through the planet? It's the planet, the wall? I thought I saw something in the wall just now. I don't know. I think I did, but I don't know what it was. Anyways, we're going to just head on up. Can just jump. Woo! I actually did it correctly. I didn't think I did. I just run back up. And then double jump. There we go. And then where do I go? There's a painting there. Look at that painting of Patrick with the dolphin and a Krabby Patty. Okay, bro. Who made these arts? Like, like not in game, but in real life. Who made these arts? Because they're actually kind of clean. <laughs> like, I wonder. Yeah, I wonder who they got to make all this art. Unless this is. I know some of it is probably like just from the show. But I wonder if there's any like original to the game. That'd be cool. Um, I guess we have to jump over there. Oh, I see. So I can tilt it this way. Run over, then jump to here. Yeah, there we go. And then, oh, and then we can go over the lasers. Oh, and then we can go around. And hit that button down there. Oh, I see. I got it. And now there's a security guard, and now he's dead. And there's another button here. Let's hit that. That turns him off. Let's go. And it spawned a bunch of enemies. Oh, my God. Security's after me, bro. Get out of here. Watch this. I'm about to body all that security. Look at that. They're all dead. I didn't even take damage. Also, how did this... This dude must have gotten locked in the museum when all the security was on. He's the only person in here. Do you notice that? Like, he was the only one in here appreciating the art. And he got locked up in here with all the lasers. And then he's just going to dance around. Like, bro, he could have hit some of them buttons, you know? You, he can't jump. Like, SpongeBob, he can't jump on, like, these platforms and stuff. No, of course, they got away from me. Oh, a golden spatch. Let me take that. Let's go. So that's 30. So I think that means we officially have enough to get to the next area, but obviously we're not going to go yet. I don't know if Rock Bottom has another... Oh, I forgot these fall. But I don't even care. <laughs> but I don't know if Rock Bottom has another segment past the museum. Oh, yeah, and the platforms do respawn. That's good. I was worried. But yeah, I don't know if there's another... Is that Bubble Buddy up here? Why do they have, like... Oh, these must be, like, statues. Why do they have real-life just statues of the characters in here? Bro... Is that legal? Are they allowed to have statues of just some children in here? Hold on. Who's running this place? Who is running this museum? We need to call the police. Because oh, that, that's just not allowed. You can't just be having paintings of children. Did their parents consent? I doubt it. That's not even paintings. I meant like full recreated models of these kids. I don't think that's allowed. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. I get it. They're heroes. But even, look at Mermaid Man's face. Though. We look so concerned. Where do they like... What's the reference picture for this model? Where did they get it from? Like, bro, why does he look so scared, scared and sad? Like, I, he Loki looks alive. Barnacle Boy's about to blast open this glass. Look at it; it's like a bubble. He's like, "Don't worry, Mermaid Man, I got this." And he's about to blast it open. Like, bro. And then Bubble Buddy, of course, just he, I, it doesn't even look like he's facing the glass, bro. Like, okay, of course, Bubble Buddy's just chilling in there. But like. Yeah, what's the reference picks for Mermaid Man looking this sad and afraid? Like, hold, why would they put this in here anyways? Like, they're supposed to be superheroes. Make them look heroic. I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna just jump across here. Open up this box so we can get back here faster. And you're gonna shoot a nuke at me and then... Boom. Look at these two. They're vibing in here. I'm about to beat them both up. Look at this combo. Oh, I tripped this one and knocked that one back. Look at that. <laughs> I'm gonna make it a point to beat up all the fish in the game, but that's part of 100%. You gotta hit every fish. No, you don't. But um, oh, was I supposed to go up there? I might have. I might have needed to do that. Why do they have snail food? Okay, 
Oh, for real, who's running the- Look at this naked picture of Spongebob! Bro, censor that! Censor that! Get that off my screen! I can't have that on YouTube, bro. And then, they really use snail food as the lamp. Like, that's how they're directing the light. Who is running this place for real? This is like the most... I don't know, this is some weird place. But Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy... That's the thing, Mermaid Man or Barnacle Boy, though, he said he runs security in this place, so he's aware of these statues in here, bro. He has to go check. He was just okay with it. They must be, like, blackmailing him or something. I know I would have been a little pressed. Especially with if I was Mermaid Man, because, like, bro, they really got a statue of me looking all shook. Like, I'm a hero. Make me look heroic. Like, dang. <laughs> At least, put, like... Wait, okay, if, that, if the scared one was, like, along with a heroic one, then fine. But... The only one they have is me looking scared and shook. Like, bro. What? Like, where'd they get that picture from? Look at Squidward up here. Look at these tires. Look at their... They really have lamps as their lights. Or, I mean, big tires for their lamp. Are those living people? Huh? These are really living fish in here. They have li... Oh my, if this dude don't try to stop, don't stop trying to snipe me, I'm come over here. Snake. I'm about to beat him up. Alright, there we go. Now there's a child just chilling up here. Look at this Squidward painting, bro. But hold on, let, let's go back. Hold on. These are living old people in here. What's up with this museum? Look at her popping wheelies on her. If you don't get out of here popping wheelies on your wheelchair. Like, oh my god. But look, they are living fish in there look at that you can even see it the glass that's a whole real living fish there's three of them why are they allowed to be locked up in here like this this isn't a zoo it's a museum why are they locked up like this hold on i'm getting out of here i'm done with this museum oh my god like i was a i was shook by like the actual statue models downstairs but these are living fish what we need to bust them out of here. We gotta blow up this museum after we evacuate, obviously. And then there's this dude. Like, look, this one also looks like a statue because he's not moving. So I think this one's a model. But those old ones were living. So they're just gonna put old dying fish in a museum just because their life's almost over. You think you could just monetize them? Like, bro, no. It's not okay. And then they got replicas of SpongeBob Street, even though it's backwards because SpongeBob's house is on the right. And Patrick's is on the left, but whatever. If this cloud don't stop following me, who's even spawning that? Oh, you? Uh, what am I supposed to do about you, bro? But yeah, they got replicas of the houses. Like, okay. They got it backwards. And they got another painting up here. Who Who are these fish? These must. This must be some Greek mythology fish. Like, from, from Rome, Greece, I don't know. But yeah, look, these ones are, again, statues, because they're not moving. So it's just models. You know, it's uh, sculptures of people, but I'm telling you, those ones with those kids were real. How do I get that sock? That's what I want to know. I mean, jump across the. Oh, there's. A I just fell all the way down. Let's go back in the. I just realized this box is floating. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that, but it's floating. Let's go up here. Let's go in here to pop back out up here. I gotta run back all the way around because I fell. I'll meet y'all back up there. Y'all want to know the. The other messed up part about this, though, this dude, Barnacle Boy, runs security here. He knows these old people are trapped in here. And he's just not doing anything about it. Like, bro, I get it. You're retired. You don't want to go move back in with your son. But you can't just let old people be living in here like this. They got kidnapped, and you're just going to let it happen? You're a superhero. I mean, you might be an ex-superhero, but you're still a superhero. Like, bro, do something. Throw a bubble ball. I don't know. Waterball them assemble the creatures of the deep i don't know do something anyways all right we're back over here now and i guess to get up there i need to jump from here that's the only thing i would assume right no how do you get how do you get those i don't know because there's a sock up there and then like a sock way over there but that like up uh, over oh yeah there's a there's also a painting over there but you see that little hole i'm assuming that's the exit of the museum but i don't want to leave yet before getting those socks I just don't know how you get them. Maybe I need to come back here later. Maybe I can switch characters or something. Like maybe I could be Sandy and float over later. Uh, yeah, we'll probably just come back. But at least we know that those are there now. So, yeah, I'll meet y'all back over there. All right, we're back over here. But, yeah, we're just going to leave for now. 
Because, like, I don't see any way I could really make the jump to get to those, um, to get to those socks. So I'm just gonna not worry about it for now. My only assumption is that we can switch to, like, Sandy or something later. This lady really just in here admiring their own body here. Or spinning all the way around and stuff. Got another painting. But yeah, so this is the exit, but I really don't see a way to get in there. Unless we can be Sandy or something. Or I can kill those guys somehow. But then, again, the only way I could think to even kill them is with Sandy's lassos. I'm assuming we gotta come back in here with Sandy somehow. Oh, you know what? Can't we switch right before the museum? Isn't there a little thing there? To switch care? I think that's what it is. Because, yeah, I became SpongeBob before coming in here. I think I gotta come back through here as Sandy. So, yeah, before I leave, I'm gonna go switch real quick. Uh, I'll cut it all out, though. Y'all y'all will see me back in here as Sandy collecting the socks. So, yeah, I'll see y'all in a second. Okay, we're back over here now. So, yeah, we're back at this area. We're gonna go get these socks with Sandy. Because, yeah, now I can float like this. That'll let me grab the socks. You see the robot examining... I see looking at the children. We gotta snipe him. Can I, can I like lasso him? Oh no, he noticed me. He's trying to nuke me. Alright, I'm out of here, bro. I'm out of here, bro. Did he just kill himself? I think he just, did he just blow himself up? Okay, no, he didn't. I thought he did. But yeah, we're gonna go collect these socks. And then, I guess we'll just stay as Sandy as we leave. Because we're already here now. I don't feel like going back again. But yeah, we'll just stay as Sandy. So yeah, we got these two socks. Then we'll, so we'll fly back over here. And then yeah, we're gonna go to the exit now. Uh, and then hopefully there's another place to switch if we need it later, like outside. There's another button down there. Did I already? I think I've, I think all the buttons just reset because I think I've hit that one already. Yeah, all the buttons did reset. I can see a way over there. Okay, I have hit that one before. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead. Look at this. They really got Sandy and Patrick. Why are they up in this bathroom with Gary? Like, bro, why? What is up with them having like statues there? They didn't have a single one of SpongeBob though. Y'all notice that they didn't have SpongeBob nowhere in this museum. How much you wanna bet? This tunnel is going to lead to... Like, I'm not even going to read the title of it yet. Oh. Wait, what's that for? Wait, huh? What does that lead to? Hold up. Hold up. I need to go kill these robots. The ones that are shooting lightning? I need to kill them. How though? How do you expect me to kill them? What am I supposed to do? I don't know how I'm supposed to kill them, but I'm going to figure it out. Yeah, those things are spawn. But how much you want to bet this this next part of the museum? Like, this isn't going to exit. It's going to lead to, like, a SpongeBob monument. Like, a SpongeBob memorial or something like that. I'm going to just start swinging then, I guess. I can't really get rid of this guy anyway from what I'm seeing. I'm just going to swing. Because I want to see where this leads to. What's the point of this? Does this not lead to anything? Uh, it doesn't look like at least anything specific. Is it just a... Oh, I think it's just an easier way to get across. If you come back through here as Sandy. Oh, you know what it probably was? You are probably supposed to get that when you came through as Spongebob. So you knew to come back as Sandy. And this was a quicker way up. I guess. I don't know. But I still got through here a different way. But, um... Yeah, we're just gonna go back then. I thought I, thought I was gonna lead somewhere. But I think it's just... I think that was to let you know you need to come back as Sandy to get those socks. I think that's all it was. So yeah, we're gonna head out to the. We're gonna head to the next area now. They really got a SpongeBob like. Oh, what's this thing called? I know what it is, but um, it's like an anatomy thing, but it's a SpongeBob one. So let's see. This leads. It the trench of advanced darkness. Oh, let's go. Let's go to advanced darkness then. Let's go. Oh, whoa! They cannot just throw me in there like that. I almost died. Look at that. Oh, this is how we get to the slide. This is dope. So wait, was the area... So this outside area is called the Trench of Advanced Darkness. Oh, I see. Notifications are on. I'm just gonna, you know, get rid of that. Uh, so yeah, this is the end of the slide. So this is like a whole new area. Also, give me a second. Okay, we're back. Um, Yeah, but this is like a whole new... This was like a different slide, I think. Did I even go around the whole thing? I'm not even sure. But we're at the end of it now, so... I guess this is a whole new segment. Oh. You're on an awful long walk, aren't you? Wow. The trench of advanced darkness, huh? Sounds dark. Okay, Gary, I'll be extra, extra, extra careful. So, get why? Is, yeah, for real. Why is Gary down here? He really is taking a kind of a long walk to be down here. But um. Yeah. So. It's yeah, that. What's up with there? It says e exit. 
So is that where we're heading to? I don't know. So we can swap to who? Probably Patrick, right? We haven't played a same in a minute. Oh no, back to Sandy. Okay. Was okay to chop. Dang! <laughs> oh my gosh! Why does... <laughs> when Sandy slaps him, it's so... Like, there's so much effort, so much force behind it. Jeez. Oh, but that's why I need to be Sandy to... Oh, no, never mind. These would just spawn anyways. You see that thing just fly off and die? Go over here, because it's a sock. Um, I can bubble bowl. Oh, this was just leading. Is this going somewhere, or is it stop? No, it just stops here. Why did they let me be Sandy, though? Right now. It looks like I need to be SpongeBob. Let's run. Let's just run around here, see what's there. Oh, yeah, there's a like, locked gate. So, yeah, we gotta be SpongeBob for here. So, yeah, I'm still wondering what these pipes are all about. I feel like this is gonna connect to the boss fight somehow, which is super cool. Which, you know, that, again, relates to what I was saying before, how this... This whole area has like the perfect atmosphere. So if all those pipes somehow relate to the boss, that would be fire. But, I mean, unless there's no boss in this area, then I would just go and explain. That would have been great potential. Oh, wait, we can get up there? Hold up. Is that why we needed to be Sandy? Let me see. Is there even a way up? Not really. But no, there's no way we needed to be Sandy. You see Gary was clicking his eyes. Um, There's no way we needed to be Sandy to get up here. Oh wait, we can get up. Oh, got sniped. Okay, tiptoe. Let's go. All right, we're up here. There was a. Oh, we can be Sandy up here, but I don't think we can actually get up here as Sandy. Cause there's a swing thing, but I think we need to spawn more. There's some way out there. So I guess we have to do something up here as Sandy. But I, mo I mostly came up here for this, the, the painting. So let me grab that. Cause then we only need one more. Yeah. So. I'm just, maybe we have to go back on the slide at some point and jump up here as Sandy? Otherwise, I don't know. I guess for now, we're just going to head down as Spongebob. And then we might come back if we need to. Because, like, I can go up here as Sandy, but I also don't really see a point to. Unless I just cheese this with Spongebob and I wasn't supposed to be it. That's happened a lot in this game, though. I've cheesed a lot of things. <laughs> like, there's just a lot of ways that you can do things. Like, the unintended way. And I don't even mean to. I just play, and I'm just like, okay, I could s there's a way to get up, so I'm going to do it. <laughs> so, yeah, but we're going to go over here as SpongeBob for now, because we have to use his, like, powers and stuff, right? So, we, I think we have to hit this button and roll around real quick. Yeah. Let's do that. Get the, oh, six seconds. Got to go fast. But we made it. We built different. That gate going to come back. Oh, no, it didn't come back. We already passed it. All right. Let's stand here. That's going to lift us up. We got it. Because we're in this guy's range, he can attack us. Let's hit him. So I... Th yeah, because look, we can swing to the platform from here as Sandy. I think I was supposed to use Sandy to get that painting. That's, that's, what, it, that's what it's seeming like, but... I don't know. But we can also... There's more areas to swing around as Sandy. We also just opened this box. Is this box connected to another one? No. I think now that I've done that as Spongebob, I can't... So I think I do have to go through this area as Sandy at some point. But for now, we're just going to run through it as Spongebob. Because I, f I guess there's things I got to do as both, is what it's seeming like. Because, yeah, it looks like to progress from here, I got to be Sandy. But I can go this way, and that leads to... It says a bridge. It doesn't really say specifically what. But let's use it. Oh, that... Oh, you see those platforms over there? There's... Wait, is that what it did? Oh, no, I'm an idiot. What did that do? Was it those platforms that started moving? I think that's what it is. Those platforms to the exit started moving. So whenever we need to leave... It looks like we have to get to the exit through a box. That's interesting. Oh, there's a re there's a shiny object all the way up there. Do are we gonna be there at some point? I don't know. But there is also this. So let's go on it. There's. Oh, there's a sock down here. Cool. We're gonna get all these sh shiny objects too. But yeah, I think those platforms that were moving back there is what that did. So now I think we gotta switch to Sandy, and then we can finish up the area. I so I guess the exit's like. I'm assuming the end of rock bottom. But I'm not sure. Um Let's go switch to Oh, woo! Whoa. Whoa, but Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna switch to Sandy and then head over there. And then Yeah, we'll progress a little bit. We are gonna end off the episode in a little though, because we are getting pretty close to 30 minutes. But yeah, um, so let's go down. Switch back to Sandy, and then we'll swing across. Cause it, yeah, it looks like the rest of the area we have to swing for it. So yeah, we're going to switch to Sandy. I'm at least going to start swinging and stuff before we end off the episode. So we're going to go do that. So yeah, switch to Sandy. Go this way. Do these flips. 
flipped. Yeah, because I think we just needed SpongeBob to like open up this. Kind of seems pointless though, because I don't know. I feel like they could have done it better, because they made us open this with SpongeBob only to need Sandy from here on out. Like I don't know. Kind of seems a little flawed to me, but it's whatever. So I'll lift this up, please. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, we're gonna start swinging. So we can go left. There's a big laser in the middle too. I don't know what that's about. So you best not be stirring up no trouble. Nonsense! I only want to help. Help crush you all under my rise to power. What was that? Nothing. Say, see those lasers there? You mean them things that look like fancy washing machines? To your puny brain, I suppose. You'll need to turn on each one of those in order to cross the last part of the trench of advanced darkness. This better not be some kind of trick, varmint. Varmint. Um, you know what? Honestly, I think we're going to end the episode off right there. That seems like a really good stopping point. We have got through the whole museum today. Now we're here at the the Trench of Advanced Darkness. We have a whole new segment with lasers and stuff. This feels like a good way to end. And he said those lasers unlock the final area. So, yeah, I think that we're going to end the episode off right there. So, uh, thank y'all varmints for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, make sure you slap that like button. Subscribe. You know, if you haven't subscribed already, then subscribe. If you have subscribed already, go ahead and do it again. Why not? Just, just like... Okay, I'm unsubscribing, not, not for long. Just unsubscribe and resubscribe right away, you know? Just just go ahead and subscribe again, you know? Or if you don't want to be subscribed anymore, you can unsubscribe too. That's cool. But, you know, just make sure you, if you like this video that much, make sure you like it. Share it around to your grandma, your grandpa, your coworkers, your manager, whoever you want to share it with. And if you really, really like this video that much, you might consider going down there and putting it into your favorites playlist. But, yeah. Till next time, though. We're going to see what these lasers are all about in the next episode. So until then, I'll see you all later. And peace. Have a good day, y'all.